Vermont. It's a thought that could lead to some unhappy kids and even some unhappy adults this summer. The mayor of Coachella says there's too many ice cream trucks in his city. Angela Monroe is here now to tell us what about those trucks has upset, upset the mayor so badly. Angela. Elizabeth Coachella's mayor decided his city has too many ice cream trucks after a man driving one was arrested Monday. Police say the man exposed himself to two girls. Now the mayor says there are just far too many ice cream vendors in Coachella. The sight of the traveling truck carrying sweets is irresistible for kids. I take my kids every day to go get ice cream. So Eileen Herrera was shocked to hear this ice cream truck driver, Israel Valdez Ayala, was arrested by police. He's charged with exposing himself to young girls. Some parents told me Ayala used to park his ice cream truck on this corner by the school. He was arrested just a few blocks away. Right here in the same, same area, right here. Jose De La Torre says some vendors sell more than just ice cream. They sell all their bad stuff for, you know, maybe marijuana and cocaine. And the Coachella Mayor Eduardo Garcia says there are too many ice cream trucks in the city, about 60. So he says no more. Three ice cream men come to my um, apartment complex every day and I did not have a clue what they do. Ice cream sellers told me off camera they agree there are too many trucks in town. They're a common sight at schools, parks, and around neighborhoods. Keep them away from the schools and, uh, and the churches. When Jose's granddaughters have a sweet tooth, he steers clear of ice cream trucks. No more I take them to the store and buy whatever they want. And Eileen says it's a good idea to limit the number of trucks. I think it's a great idea. I mean, it's a lot safer. You know, who's going to be around the apartments, who's going to come in and be around your kids almost every day. Coachella City Council will vote on May 8th on whether or not to stop giving out ice cream vendor permits in the city. Gino, Elizabeth.